What's up? It's Beth in the kitchen in the house in Manchester making dinner. Tonight we're making a steam fry. Now the reason for this video is because we've been hanging out with students today and they all keep saying they can't afford to eat or cook vegan. So we're going to give you a breakdown of how much this meal costs. So come over here Lou. Um, so a dinner of steam fried vegetables. We got half a head of broccoli. We've estimated it's about 30p. A whole beetroot, another 30p. A whole carrot and a half, so cheap, but we're going to say 30p. Uh, zucchini, about 50p. Capsicum, again, about 30p. And this teensy slither of ginger, about 10p. So that's that. We've also got this dish over here by Louis, this Jerusalem artichoke dish, where we got all of those Jerusalem artichokes for a pound. Then we got these tomatoes here for about, I think we estimated another 50p. So, this whole, oh, and we're having half a bunch of kale, 50p. And I'm going to be making Jerusalem artichokes and tomato dish. So I've already chopped up my Jerusalem artichokes. I'm just going to stick the heat on in a pan, stick a little bit of water in there, stick all the Jerusalem artichokes in, and wait for them to steam up. So you want to cover it, but we haven't got a lid, so we're just going to stick that on. Yep. All right, and we're also going to chuck in some of this miso, which is probably going to be about 10 peas worth. Now, you might notice that we're not using oil. One, oil's expensive, but two, it's really bad for you, so we think it's just pure fat, and we don't want to be eating pure fat because we've learnt that too much fat in the diet inhibits your absorption of calcium and many other things, and we want to thrive. All right, so first step, grab your stir fry pan, chuck it on the hob, turn the hob on, chuck in your wee bit of water, not too much. So first things first, we've chucked in the ginger, I'm also going to put in our more firm vegetables like carrots, beets. We're also going to chuck in the stalk of the broccoli because it's quite firm. And then we'll chuck the other things in a little later because they cook much faster. Roughly chop your tomatoes. And then when this is all looking kind of nice and steamed, stick them in. All the juice. Give it a little mixer. Stick few herbs in there, we've got mixed herbs. Alright, we're ready for the other veg. So just chuck in your zucchini bits. Ours look like this because they're the bits left over from spiralizing. You can see our other videos if you're wondering what spiralizing is. Chuck in the zucchini, capsicum and broccoli. And just so you know, you don't have to use these veg. Just use whatever veg you like or whatever veg you got at home. I'm sure it will taste amazing. What are some good options to use? Broccoli, capsicum, zucchini, carrot, if you like onion or garlic, chuck in those. Uh, like mushrooms, peas, spinach, um, green beans, anything. Uh, corn, baby corn. So ready to go in. So I've just chucked in about a heaped tablespoon of miso. Boiled the kettle because it helps it dissolve better. Just chuck in a wee bit of boiling water like so and just keep mixing it until it's a nice consistency. Tip it all in. Make sure I don't leave any in the jar. Like so. Give it a quick little mix so that we coat the veggies in it. Don't need to be too spot on, that's good enough. And now chuck in the kale. Kale goes in last because it's a leafy green and your leafy greens cook really quickly and you don't want them to wilt too much in there. Like we did with the artichokes, we'll chuck our board on top to let it steam a little. If you've got a lid, chuck a lid on and we'll wait for that to steam. And again, you know it's done when everything's nice and soft. You don't want your broccoli too soft, so that's still kind of firm. And your kale is soft but not wilted, so that is perfect. Perfect, look at that. Boy, fat. How okay. colourful is it? Absolutely demolished. Don't be afraid to lick your plate. You can lick mine too if you want. Mm. <laughs> this is Fruity and Five. Like, comment, subscribe.